Track 60. Conversation 1. I'm sorry to hear that you didn't get the grades to get into university. What are you going to do now? I'm not sure. I can take my exams again at the local college, but I'm not sure if I want to do that. Maybe I'll take a vocational course there instead to learn the skills for a particular job like accountancy or business studies. At least if I pass that, I can go straight into work. Conversation 2 So, how's Jenny settling down? It's always difficult when they start school. My son Timmy took weeks to get used to being away from me all day. Oh, she's fine. She loves it, especially learning to write. She doesn't miss me at all. I'm the one with the problem. I really miss her being at home all day. But after all, it's the law. She has to go. Conversation 3 I found this evening course in photography at my local centre. It's two evenings a week and only costs £150 for the term. You've always been interested in photography as a hobby. Why don't you come too? Oh, I did that course last year. It's really good. I'm planning to take a course on setting up a website so that I can display all my photos. It does seem strange, though, to be learning something new again after so many years. Conversation 4 I think it's really useful for them to start early. I know it can be expensive, but it's worth it because they already know what it's like to be with others in a class when they start school. Mm, that's true. In my case, it's not just the benefits of socialising with other children. It also means I can go back to work. It's a pity I can't get a free place for my son, though I don't have to pay very much, thank goodness. Conversation 5 Well, my daughter is off tomorrow to start her degree course. A whole new adventure in a new city. <laughs> I'm nervous, but she's really thrilled about it. There's a week for the new students. It's called Freshers' Week, when they find out what they need to know, join clubs and get used to being away from home, and then the course starts the week after. Well, don't worry. I'm sure she'll be fine. After all, she's 18 now, and they all have to make their own way in the world sometime. Conversation 6 I'm a bit worried about my son. He's not doing very well. The thing is, he needs to understand that it's not like his last school, when he did everything in the same class. He has to make sure he knows his timetable and gets to the right classroom on time. He keeps getting to class late and not doing his homework. Don't worry. It often takes time for them to adjust to the idea of having more responsibility. I'm sure he'll do better when he settles down. Conversation 7 My son passed all his GCSE exams and wants to go to university in two years' time. We can't decide whether he should continue at his school or go to that new college near our house. What do you think? Well, the college has taken the best kids from the local school since it opened two years ago, and almost all of them have passed their A-levels and gone on to university. So, I think it's really good. Also, it makes them feel more grown up when they go there. <laughs>